Okay guys, this is what I wanted to show everybody. Uh, don't go to your local lawnmower stores and buy gaskets for $5, which is uh, usually what they cost. Um, I went and rebuilt a carburetor and it cost me about $10 uh, to rebuild it with new gaskets. Um, this is what I'm going to show you. It cost me right at $15. I can't remember what it was. I think it was a little bit under because uh, it kind of surprised me for the price. Uh, it came from eBay. I mean, if you want your carburetor fixed like that day, you know, and you know how to clean it or whatever, that's fine. And you want to spend the $10, but I mean, this is a lot cheaper in the long run. I mean, this is already opened it obviously but um it's what I picked up the other day so you can see it comes a little baggy with your two gaskets here um for that gasket right there not the little o-ring but the other gasket I paid four dollars and twenty something cent at my local lawnmower parts store now you know you could have made one out of whatever but sometimes it's just better to buy the original say this little guy right here you don't want to get dust in these either uh, dust is a killer for carburetors uh, if anybody working on lawnmowers knows that but, but this is basically what I got guys you can see it's been machined and I'm pretty sure this was manufactured in China and it got shipped over here they probably got it for like what $11 that's uh, kind of a comment from my buddy Matt uh, he's got a YouTube channel he shoots guns and everyone you know he always says clip zines and stuff but uh as you can see I mean the quality is just there I mean there's nothing wrong with this carb I, and I put these carbs right on lawnmowers uh, people bring me lawnmowers you know say, man can you look at my lawnmower and I said I'll tell you what I'll look at it and uh, they drop it off and uh, and I usually tell them straight up. I said, "Well, it'll be about forty dollars, and I'll, I'll put your brand new carburetor on there, and you know, and that's after I get a can of starting fluid and check and see if it, you know, if it cranks up fine, and it's not got no knocks or pings to it. And you know, I do cut them a good deal. You know, I'm making fifteen, twenty dollars off of them, but I mean, I do cut them a good deal and give them like a free oil change. I get." oil for about two dollars a quart uh here in georgia um i get it at local roses and it's not the best oil but it's free oil change they like it they don't care uh most of my customers are repeat customers and come back like every year it's like hey you know you work on a lawnmower there's nothing wrong with it yeah I just need tune up though and uh, uh as you can see guys this is the same carburetor that's got the uh, little heat choke, the automatic choke right here. There's a little bit of play in that, but that's fine. Uh, but basically, if y'all have never seen these carburetors, instead of the bulb that you pump, and it would actually squirt gas in there, which, you know, works just as good, this one you just pull, because it automatically is going to be on choke. This thing right here will automatically be like this, and as soon as it starts up, wide open. You know, start up yeah uh but yeah i mean look at that get you a closer view though i mean new o-rings new everything i mean if you're really gonna complain about this like little scratches and stuff that's gonna go on a lot more get a life I mean that's not gonna I mean that's just perfect y'all I mean they work great too Did she see the one that I had for about the automatic start craftsman I mean I literally put the carburetor on there and before even even really you know I didn't dial it in or nothing I mean there's no adjustments on these that they just run and I mean they do awesome but uh, this video is getting kind of long, guys. I just wanted to show you what I bought. And uh, no, no, guys, there it is.
Later.